If you guys want to support me, then make sure to hit that red subscribe button below the video. And also guys, make sure to hit the bell icon to get notified of all of my new uploads. If you guys do want to win a GTA 5 shark card, then go ahead and leave 10 comments or more on the channel video below. Make sure that you guys are subscribed to the channel and then make sure to follow me on Twitter and or Skype. Both are in the description below. And without any further ado guys, let's get into this glitch video. Hello everybody, it's your boy Get Off My Beard and today guys I'm going to show you how to get invisible ankles in GTA 5 Online. So guys, without any further ado, let's go ahead and do this. The first thing you need to do guys is go ahead and start up a Rockstar created job. Go over to Adversary Mode and you're going to start up Drop Zone number 1 for the win because this thing is absolutely awesome will allow you to select the color that you choose for your pants and your helmet that you will actually keep in online I made a video about this before so guys go ahead and start up that job and then guys once it is open go ahead and invite your friends it's better if one of your friends hosts it that way you guys don't have to worry about anybody else quitting but then you guys can see you can get pink orange green purple and you guys can simply join that team and once you guys have joined that team go ahead and click on ready once you guys are loaded into the adversary mode go ahead and just stand right where you are go to style down to helmet visor spam it to the right for about 25 to 30 seconds and after you guys have spammed it then what you want to do is just simply leave your controller alone if you're on Xbox one and PC but if you guys are on PlayStation 4 then go ahead and go to like a YouTube application or anything that will suspend your video game okay so once the game is suspended it will actually come up with a message that says that you have been kicked for idling too long and that's okay because then you will then be given the option to hit continue and you will then be joining back into GTA 5 online what's cool from this point guys is that once you load back in it does take a little bit of time for the Rockstar servers to kind of figure out what's happening and why you're needing to load back into online but once you do guys you're then going to be brought back to wherever your last spawn location that you set was and you simply need to get out of the bed go ahead and save this outfit so that you don't lose it and it doesn't despawn or anything like that in case you die and then guys once you have saved your outfit you're then going to make your way over to the clothing store in the clothing store guys all you simply want to do is go over to the shoes section and you guys want to select some shoes that are going to be really low cut from these boots so I decided to go with the skate shoes because I think they look the best but you can also go with no shoes and that just leaves the very tops of your feet visible and the rest of it completely invisible ankles so guys I hope you enjoyed this video it's been your boy it's a quick one but I'm out Peace.